it's me joy welcome to reading with joy where you get to read with joy because that's me that's my name and we all get to read with joy because we love reading stories so silly bears from shilla voices and today we are reading the very hungry caterpillar by eric carl i'm sure you know this book well this is a very good book i read this book and love this book when i was growing up when i was a little wee girl too when i was a little caterpillar so are you ready to get started? Okay, so we're going to read it twice. The first time I'm just going to read it normally. If I can do that the second time, we'll have some fun. Okay, let's go. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. He started looking for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, a one ice cream, a one pickle, a one slice of Swiss cheese, a one slice of salami, a one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake and one slice of watermelon. That night he had a stomach ache. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf and after that he felt much better. Now he wasn't hungry anymore and he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon for it around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out and... He was a beautiful butterfly! Wow, look at him, he's so beautiful! And look at the beautiful dotty, dotty pictures. Look at all this stuff he's been eating through, lots of flowers I should imagine. Come on then, let's read it again. This time you can join in with me a little bit and we'll 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 say some, some bits and bobs, maybe some silly bits and bobs. Are you ready? In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. Can you see it? Oh, look at the moon smiling. Smile at the moon. It's a very, very pleasant smile. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. Look, there he is. Look at his cute face. Oh, and look, the sun's smiling as well. Mmm, I smile when the sun comes up, that's for sure. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple. But he was still hungry. Right, let's put our finger through the apple. Hello, I'm a caterpillar and I'm sticking and coming all the way out the other side. There he is. On Tuesday, he ate through one, two pears, but he was still hungry. Look, it's a pair of pears. Two pears. Two pears make a pear. There he is, popping out again. Put my finger in behind. Hello, hello. My finger can be the caterpillar. On Wednesday, he ate through one, two, three plums. But he was still hungry. Are you saying that with me? 
There's the three plums. Let's put my finger through. One, two, three. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries. Are you ready? Let's count them. One, two, three, four. But he was still hungry. Now let's put our fingers through. Broken through. Oh, look at this artwork by Addy. Addy did this artwork because this book belongs to Addy. Addy has lent me this book to read to her. Thank you so much, Addy. I'm so glad you did. This really is one of my favourite books and I really, really, really wanted to read it. And then you gave it to me to read to you and do a shout out. So big hello to you and fabulous, fabulous artwork in your book. Mm, brilliant. On Friday, he ate through five oranges. Let's count them. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five. Are you ready to say it with me? But, but he was still hungry. Let's turn over. On Saturday, he ate through. Oh, Saturday is my favourite day. Is this the best page ever? It is, isn't it? Look at all this gorgeousness. He ate through one piece of chocolate cake. Nom, 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 nom. He ate through one ice cream cone. A nom, 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 nom. He ate through one pickle. A nom, 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 nom. A one slice of Swiss cheese. Um, nom, 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 nom. I had Swiss cheese today as I snack earlier. I melted it in the microwave. Just one slice. It was very nice. Emmental. Nom, 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 nom. <gasps> one slice of salami. Nom, 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 nom. One lollipop. Nom, 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 nom. A one piece of cherry pie. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, one sausage. Nom, 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 nom. One cupcake. Nom, 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 nom. And one slice of watermelon. Yum, 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 yum. That night he had a stomachache. Well, I would too if I'd eaten all of that. What's your favourite thing on these pages? What's your favourite bit of food? I think mine has got to be... I don't know. I don't know, actually. I think the cake. I always opt for cake. I'm going to go for the cake with a cherry on the top. Or I might flick the cherry off the top because I'm not bothered about that. What about you? What do you like? The ice cream? You like the lollipop? You like the lollipop? Tip. What's that? You like the pickle? Well, I'm very glad to hear it. Very healthy. Let's turn over. Oh, the next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf. Come on, let's get him come eating the leaf. And after that, he felt much better. Yes, good for you, Caterpillar, for eating your greens. But now he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little Caterpillar anymore. He was a big fat Caterpillar. He could be called a fatterpillar. <laughs> and he built a small house called, what's it called? A cocoon, well done, around himself. And he stayed inside for more than two weeks. So he ate the first week he spent eating. Yum, 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 yum. And then two more weeks, he's wrapped himself up in a cocoon. And then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon. I'm probably thinking, this doesn't actually taste as nice as that watermelon I had or any of the other stuff. And he pushed his way out. And what's he become? He was a beautiful butterfly. Oh, it's so beautiful. He's got a little smiley face. He's still got the same face. His body's not that different, but look at those wings. Gorgeous. <laughs> what a great book. Did you enjoy that? What kind of snacks are you going to be eating today? I do hope that you have a very healthy week eating and maybe just save the naughty snacks for Saturday. But don't eat as many as he did. And do join me again in my next video. You're going to come and join me in another video. I really hope so. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.